the energy vibrations um reading for the gemini sun moon and rising sign i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibrations um please like shares and subscribes and subscribe and share 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 these videos these are going to be good okay this week is the third week of february and i want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back wonderful positive energy vibration this is going to be good whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring we are going to be seeing how this week is going to be coming out this is a, a, a hair week all over the energy vibration is the full which is a positive energy of the hair energy monday and tuesday is the air energy and it changes on Tuesday to the water energy so we have water in here that is going on in this week as I look at your week there is a wonderful situation that is going to be coming in in this week because we you begin the week with um, the energy of the star which is very good this is a positive positive um, situation it's as if some of you your wishes whatever you were open for and manifest in Monday you could see this coming out Tuesday is an earth energy and this is really really positive because you had to make a decision over a situation and you already make the decision um, the center of the week is that you have an um, and uh, a fire energy and again um, whatever the decision you have made it's the right decision because um, you know that it's um, the right decision because um, you are not waiting any longer your ship is coming okay so you're not standing waiting any longer your ship has come in now some help is going six of one some good news is going to be coming in um, for some of you if you are dealing with a situation um, with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, I, some good news is going to be coming in another earth sign that is coming up on Friday so um, it could be for some of you a message that your father if your father is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or if your father was sick there is some good news that is going to be coming in your weekend is stable because you have a fire energy and an earth energy and this is really good um, whatever that has been transpiring you definitely is a week where some of you are going to be connected with your father some of you maybe have to make some decision about your father whatever that situation is you have to make some decision about your father or a father figure um some of you it could be your husband if your husband is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're going to be making some decision if your husband is a Taurus a Virgo or Capricorn um, you're going to be receiving some good news from him the center of your reading some of you are going to be dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn lady so again ladies and gentlemen um, your family there could be a situation that is happening with your parents in this week and some of you definitely there could be some situation that is happening to your parents in this week and whatever is transpiring and happening you need to connect with your parents okay some of you could be helping out your parents and bringing um, some um, on expected situation to um, positive positive outcomes okay so what is uh, the star saying to the Gemini in this uh, third week again the three of ones is coming up so some of you have been manifesting something and this manifestation has come through and uh, you're seeing it coming in in this week okay and this is good three times number three is going to be your energy vibration definitely um, that is happening now the energy of the star also have justice coming in and you or um, whatever the situation is some justice is coming in and that is good because whatever situation there is going to become a balance and an end to the situation okay justice made the last strike and said this is it and you have accept you no longer need to make a decision it doesn't have to be a legal situation it can be a situation where um and it can be a legal a, a, a legal situation for some of you where okay all right I guess I have to accept and look forward and move away from this situation okay is it a win-win 
and that's not what I'm seeing I'm seeing you manifesting that a situation comes to an end and you're looking for new avenues okay so it's not like oh you win this legal suit it's just that it has been resol a resolution is here and you're moving forward okay the two of Pentacles in reverse what is that saying to us um, for the Gemini's two of Pentacles reverse what is that saying to us for the Gemini um, whatever the decision is is now you've made the decision and you're worried okay it's as if a decision was made and you're worried whatever it is um, the decision that you have made you're worried about this decision but you are going to be receiving help and the help is going to be coming from your spirit guides and hurt angel people who are going to be helping you moving you forward okay so not to worry because some of you made a decision to leave a situation behind some of you made a decision there was some imbalances um um, that was happening in your life and what has transpired is that a balance comes in and you accept this balance but you accept this balance but there is there's a lot of worrisome situation and someone could be receiving help from a Virgo or it could be earth angels people who are very kind who are going to be helping you to move forward okay now the three of ones in the reverse what is the message for the three of ones in reverse so it has to do with conflicts and you are deciding to move away from this conflicts okay you have already decided bye I, I am not getting involved with this conflict so, um, it, it's as if you realize that there was so much dishonesty that you're moving away from this conflict and said no I'm not doing it and by accepting that because you already um, decided that these lies and deception is better for you to just turn your back and that is what you have done and with the angel with the help of other people that is going to be coming in your life because you're worried you know but you decide yes I'm going to make that move and earth angels are going to be coming in to help you and these are people that just help you out of nothing it's just that they realize what is transpiring is going to help you there's definitely some of you were um, dealing with a conflict so, and you saw that okay the six of one some news is going to be coming in and whatever this news that is coming in is going to make you decide bye don't want to deal with it anymore goodbye goodbye people that is definitely whatever news is coming in you're going to be saying bye and um it has a situation to do with the king of swords now be careful and be careful you men 45 years and older you men 45 years and older just let it go let it go because it's really going to affect you men 45 years and older um, because whatever the news is coming in you're going to decide to let it go whatever the news that is coming in it's a conflict you have been going on with you're going to decide to let it go okay the king of Pentacles who are you and how are you going to be affecting um, the Gemini's and for some of you this man your parents there is a situation definitely karmatic the wheel of fortune karma okay so these are your parents because um whenever your parents your sisters and brother comes in it's always karma that you need to um clear with them this person is coming up as a father figure um it could be a boss or a father figure and whatever the situation is uh, um, this person could be bringing you um, some luck okay this is definitely a karm a karmatic situation and this person could be bringing you some luck because obviously this person is going to be telling you something and whatever this person is going to be telling you it has to do with money and it's as if this person is going to be helping you to release yourself out of a, a burden some situation that you have been dealing with definitely this person is going to say to you just walk away walk away from the situation leave it you know I'm gonna help you to get out of this situation some of you are dealing with the knight of wands who is this knight of wands it's coming up as a, another father figure because I'm seeing the father and the mother that is coming up this could be um 
If your mom is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, and your father is an Aries, Leo, or a Capricorn, uh, Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius, um, it could be your, your father and your mom. So check out who is your mom and who is your father to see what is happening. Um, obviously, whatever the situation is, is that you are going to be um, winning from this person okay you're definitely going to be winning from this person whoever this person is and however this person affects your life okay it could be a conversation with your parents and you're going to be showing them the light okay because you have a strong foundation over this person you definitely have a strong foundation over this person okay this person could have done something injustice this could be someone who you have known from the past has done something very injustice but you're going to be winning and you have and have a strong foundation over this person and this is good because this person is um whether it's your father is as if he knows exactly um you could be um you know letting your parents know that hey i want to buy a house and this and this and that and your father is there and you're going to be given good arguments um why is it you want this house and you're going to be um ending up receiving this house it could be your parents some of you your parents could want to sell the house or move away and they want to give the house to you and uh, um, you're going to be winning the arguments why you should have it where you know you're the last one and you should be the one who's receiving it whatever you wanted to do with it or they're going to be leaving you in charge of the house that's sort of a situation but um, whatever the argument is whatever is going on it's going to be good the four of Pentacles is here with the energy of the four of Pentacles some of you are going to be walking away and leaving a situation so if you are married to a Taurus, Virgo or a Capricorn or an Aries, Leo or a Sagittarius, you're definitely going to be walking away from this person. Whoever this person is, whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, you're definitely going to be walking away from this person. Okay? You're um it could be um you bought a house with someone and you're going to decide, "Hey, I'm leaving this house behind." I um you know, but it could be that some of you between the ages of 18 and 45 you're gonna be screaming going at someone it could be a father figure it could be um, this lady maybe you are in a relationship with this lady and you both have a, um, you know bought a house together and whatever and you're screaming at this lady and you're gonna say blah 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 you know whatever the news is and whatever that is coming in because I'm seeing that you're going at someone and saying hey this and this and whatever the situation is this and this is happening whatever the situation is and you're I you're like mm -mm, no and the person is just going to stand back and look at you and you know whatever it is you know you have to have respect to someone else whatever the situation is you definitely have to have respect to someone else okay all right so let's see what is coming out with the Queen of Pentacles um, some of you is the end of a situation if you were in relationship with this person um, an end is going to be coming in and you're going to be moving forward be careful what you do and remember um, what you have I've said to this person okay so don't go back on your word with this person because you need to remember what you have said to this person and do not go back on your word because some of you are going to try to go back on your word and this person is going to say no that wasn't what you say that wasn't how it was so be careful what is happening because if you try and go back on your word this person is going to get you um, because it's as if you have gave given this person your word about something and then in this week you're going to try and go back on your word this is not very good whatever is um, transpiring okay so let's see what's happening for the Gemini so we're looking at the energy of the Oracle so some of you are finally going to be ending a situation with um, um, it could be your wife also so if some of you are married to a Taurus Virgo Capricorn woman um, you could be ending a fight with this person you could be definitely ending a fight with this person because the fight is over a house and um, definitely you're going to be ending a fight with this person and move on so we're asking the hour the Oracle what is coming up for um, the Gemini's in this week from the Oracle okay for the Gemini Sun Moon Horizon sign what is coming up card one 
and card two. So choose one of these cards, whether card one or card two. And if you choose card one, it says all that glitters. Sometimes not all that glitter is gold, okay? Sometimes we think that, um, and I'm always, um, you, you receive some nice stories and, this, and that sort of a thing, and you're not, you're appalled to know that what is the mask is off and you're going to be seeing the truth of a situation so this is definitely the mask is off and you're going to be seeing the truth of a situation okay now card two is deep knowing okay so some of you are going to be knowing something deeply knowing something and you're going to think okay I'm gonna let this go I'm gonna let this go some of you are going to be on new something and you're going to think okay I'm gonna let this go I'm not gonna fight it any further it is good it is better not to fight it any um, anymore let me let this go and it's gonna be much better if you keep on fighting with this there's no winning to this and you're just going to be creating more drama for yourselves and for others around you let it go definitely some of you have a situation with a house and um, if you're not going to win this, okay, um, and you have a strong foundation, some of you who are dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, you definitely have a strong foundation. Don't worry. I want to say namaste until next time.